And a lot of people that, that, that love this uh, game that we call the Afrobeats industry, especially here in the UK, which mm -hmm. is African music, pop music, hip hop and all that, mm -hmm. is that people forget the fact that there were a couple of songs that actually opened the door, that bust down the door. True. Aipo True. Go, featuring Terry, <laughs> Terry G. G. If a lot of people didn't know, it was by <laughs> Ill Bliss, yes, the yes. number one Ibo boy himself. Most definitely. That was the start. That was the start of something fantastic, yeah. especially here in the UK. Yeah. Was it a start of something great for you as well? It was. It was. Actually, that was, that was the single that, that kind of unlocked the mainstream door, mm. you know, for me, because prior to prior to then, it was always ill, Ill on the grand MC, you know, lyricist, you know, grinding, trying to come up, you know. Then, after a while, I looked at the game and I'm like, listen, you know, for you to be that successful, for you to get to that point where you're going to as as an entertainer, you need to have the big records, you need to have the records that cut across, not mm. your comfort zone necessarily, but you know those. Those tunes that you're in the club and when it comes on, everybody goes mad like, wow, you know. So I just, I got into the studio with Terry and we banged it out.